I have been looking all through this junkyard for our next car. Let's see what we find over here. Oh, there's one in the corner here. That's a generic BMW. There are BMWs in the game, so we're not going to do that one. What is this? What is this? What's that tubing? Whoa, roll cage. What are we? What is this? Dude, this thing. Oh, does that say Ford on it? Powered by Ford Performance. Dude, this thing is. Yo! The 2022 Ford Mustang car. The NASCAR Gen 7. How much horsepower does this thing have? All right, 510 horsepower. But I'm betting we could we could get even more than that. Can we build ourselves a thousand horsepower NASCAR car? So much of this car is missing, but we we got to do it. How much is this thing going to cost? Hey, $11,000. Much better than the last car we built. All right, we're buying it. Send it to the garage. And we're going to go to the garage too. All right, we are back here at the garage. This thing is really torn down, but I'm excited to build this. See how much horsepower we can get out of it and take it for a run. Let the project begin. I don't even know all the components that this car has. I've never built a NASCAR race car before. Easiest part, let's take off the tires. None of the bolts are rusty. So here we go, ready? <laughs> Definitely doesn't go as fast as a, a wheel tire remover in NASCAR. Is that what they're, what is that person called? Tell me down below. I'm not gonna Google it. Right front hub. Oh, we got. There's a few rusty bolts. This car's been sitting a little bit. I don't understand how it's gained so much rust since 2022, literally less than a month ago. But here we are. Gotta remove the bolts with some WD-40. Oh, look, another rusty bolt. Accessible from under the car. But I'm accessing it right now. Why? I'm not gonna go and lift the car up until we take everything off that we can take off from here. Legitimately. Why can I get to this link, but I can't get to the bottom suspension arm? That doesn't make sense. All right, car part three. This is a modification on PC, so it's not gonna be what it's called, but this obviously looks like the fuel tank. There it goes, there we go. Rear bumper, rear window, body, 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 right fender. All right, let's get this fuse box out of the way. Like I said, I plan on restoring this thing to 100%. I want to see absolutely everything we can get out of it. It obviously looks like it's hit a few walls in its day. I want to see if the tack welder over there will actually take out these scratches and dents. It looks like I played the game right. See, it took away all those scratches and dents. Good to know because there's a good chance that we put some scratches and dents on it ourselves in the test drive. Done. To a bare block. Done, ready to go. All right, bring it down. Let's pull the engine block out. Over to the engine hoist. And... Presto, out. Do we build the car frame out first or do we do the engine? According to the engine specs here, we can do a V8 looks like supercharged. So let's do that because we're gonna get some good horsepower out of it. Let's put a supercharged engine in a NASCAR. Who wouldn't want that? And we're at our engine stand. Let's build a brand new engine. This is gonna take a lot of shopping. I think there's a performance fuel filter. I'm putting anything that can be performance performance on here power steering pump yep camshaft yep fuel filter on oil filter on lock in that power steering pump let's put that camshaft in crankshaft in this thing's gonna be a beast when we're done with it you know what i want to paint our timing chain cover and yes you can paint individual parts on this entire car all right we got a timing cover here i think i'm gonna go like orange paint it and there you go we got our orange timing cover add it we shop quickly around here one eternity later it's a beautiful engine hopefully it's as fast as it looks 
All right, so we got the bare frame. I'm going to go put the engine into this and just let it sit in there while we build the rest of it. Engine crane. Look at that. It already is rated 100%. Grand reveal of this engine. Oh, look at how snug it is. Ooh, supercharger's a little glitched out there. Let me put, let me put oil in it. Otherwise, I'd forget to put oil in it, so we're going to put oil in it. We got to unmount the tires. These are some tires. So I got 18s, no offset, and they're all 365, 35. I'm going to change the wheels on this. Put the wheels on the bus, go round and round. Slick tire B. All right, we got our tires, brand new tires. We just need 18s. We can choose what we want for the wheels. Classic 16 is what we're rocking. Let's do the modern rim 04. Yeah, I just installed this battery, but no, there's two batteries. That's how you know we got real power. We got two batteries. Done. This thing's got to get a thousand horsepower. I just, I, it has to. Brand new transmission. Still the same amount of bolts to get it on there. Three bolts to hold this big old thing on. I think I got a starter V8. Yeah, I do. Let's go. This thing should start right up. Add the radiator. What? How is there no fan? Let's add some power steering fluid. Power steering fluid to help us turn left. So are we doing Team Penske, RFK Racing, Stuart Haas, Front Row Motorsports? All right, I'm going RFK front end. What front end would you have chose? All right, let's start building this thing back to a race car. I'm so curious what it's going to look like because this just looks like a, like a, I don't even know. I'm curious to see and I'm ready for it. Look, I put a regular fuel tank in it, but it's going to, it's going to tell me to put a not real fuel tank in it. Like, that's so cool. Look, the filler, the filler cap so creative the seven inch spoiler oh that's what i didn't do i didn't put the fenders in now the fenders are in and it looks super nice of course i didn't get everything i needed oh they did such a good job on this front bumper however that's rfk racing it's rfk race oh my gosh this thing looks so cool rear clamshell windshield with tear offs the hood is this thing ready to like get painted and drive to the paint boo so there's obviously got to be like decal setups on this hold on gotta close the door behind you all right time to paint this thing all right look, look there was like 176 to choose from i just want you to see which one i chose it is the pb blasters sponsored number 78 nascar cup series car one thing left to do let's see if this thing runs to the dyno all right we changed the net because the pink really didn't work with the pb blaster come on dyno for me baby proceed with the dyno test factory power is 744 horsepower on this engine we put all performance parts on it let's see what we get crank it baby let's go Ooh, here we go hundred horsepower i knew we could do it i said it from the beginning and we did it dude this thing turned out incredible but now we gotta see how it drives oh boy this thing is ready to go if you want to pause the video right now and just tell me in the comments tell me what you think the top speed of this car is 1100 horsepower nascar let's go Oh, it's bogging out. The transmission's bogging out. Can we get to 200? Can we get to 200 safely? Oh, yeah, I wasn't stopping. 210. If, if we build a NASCAR car, you know that I have to go into the mods and find a track to race this thing on. So now we're at Daytona and we're going to give this thing a good test run on a circle track. Let's go. Daytona, here we come. Let's go. No speeding in the pits, right? I don't know what the speed limit in the pits is. 
But let's see if we get the black flag. Ah, no black flag. Don't hit the wall either. How about that? All right. Here we go. This is a little weird, but hey. We got ourselves a brand new Ford new gen NASCAR race car. And we are out here tearing up Daytona, baby. Here we go. Oh, hold it together. Hold it together. Hold it together. Ooh, we got this. We got this. We got this. We got this. Oh, that was actually really clean. Oh, off the wall. Ooh. That was a, that was a practice lap. Here we go. Turn one. It's so weird on controller. Let's go. Get as much speed as we can. Palm the back stretch. Two more turns. Can we do it? Two more turns. Oh boy. Sign me up. Sign me up. Don't hit the wall. Don't hit the wall. 40 what is it 43 seconds and then we win daytona what do we do what do we do Ooh. thank you for watching the video i hope you enjoyed it make sure to smash that thumbs up if you do and hey if you haven't already hit that subscribe button so you know when the next video comes out until the next one see ya